This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hi, I'm Susie Sun. Here's what's happening around the Southland right now. A pursuit ended with the car theft suspect being shot dead by police along the 215 freeway in San Bernardino. The suspect topped speeds of 100 miles an hour and hit several cars during the chase. When he rammed a police cruiser head on, officers opened fire, killing him. This local music teacher is accused of watching child porn in his classroom. Michael Duffer was arrested yesterday. Authorities say the principal at Vista Verde Elementary in Victorville saw Duffer partially undressed in his room watching the video. Duffer also teaches at Heritage School in Phelan and Wrightwood Elementary in Wrightwood. Police in Desert Hot Springs found these war medals after stopping two women in a stolen car. The medals are from the Vietnam War era. They include a purple heart and bronze star. Police hope to find whoever the medals belong to. They say the car was stolen in the Coachella Valley. The flower district in downtown Los Angeles is full of red roses and shoppers looking for a Valentine's Day deal. Customers can save as much as 70% off retail prices. The California Flower Mall will be open until 6 o'clock tomorrow night. And for the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, be sure to stay with CBSLA.com. Hello, I'm CBS meteorologist Rich Fields. Another beautiful day in Southern California, and it's going to continue for the Valentine's Day weekend. We actually topped out downtown today, 88 degrees, 19 degrees above normal for this time of the year and lots of sunshine. Clear skies overnight tonight, 55 for the overnight low. Here's a look at your extended seven day outlook, which includes your Valentine's Day, 84 downtown tomorrow. Beautiful along the coast, 79 at the beach, 84 for the valleys and IE. Still pleasant Sunday, Monday, your President's Day. Fantastic, a little bit of a cool off back to the seven for most areas and we cool off successively as we head through next week. That's a look at your forecast. Happy Valentine's Day. I'm Christine Leahy. The NBA trade deadline is next Thursday and the Lakers are maybe contemplating a move. The Lakers and Rockets are looking to possibly trade for Suns point guard Goran Dragic. The Lakers could offer a max contract to Dragic of four years, $80 million. And the NFL quarterback Peyton Manning has told the Denver Broncos that he is physically ready to return for another season. And for more sports, visit our website, cbsla.com. Now here's a look at what's coming up tonight on CBS 2 News at 11. When medical bills add insult to injury. I've got a $24,000 bill. Patients are turning to a different kind of caretaker. It was clear to me that this would not be a bill that she would have to pay. The advocates helping bust outrageous medical bills. Tonight at 11 on CBS 2 News. And that's your CBSLA.com news brief. CBSLA.com is where we are always on. Be sure to click listen live to hear KNX 1070 News Radio and our other stations anywhere you are.